Hello everyone. Welcome to my YouTube channel Life Science with KMD. Today I am going to explain about ethylene, its role, biosynthesis and effects. Ethylene is a natural plant hormone released by all plant tissue and microorganism. It is also called ripening hormone as it plays an important role in ripening process. Low concentration of 0.1 to 1 microliter is sufficient to trigger the ripening process of climateric fruits. It has autocatalytic activity because of which such small quantity can trigger further release of large quantities of ethylene by fruit tissue. A very little response is only seen to exogenous application of ethylene in in case of non-climateric fruits. Effect of ethylene on fruit ripening. Ethylene decide the post-harvest life of fruits, vegetables and cut flowers. Synthesis of ethylene varies with maturity of fruit, vegetables and flowers. Synthesis of ethylene is less in young bud while it is more in open and sentencing fruits, vegetables and flowers. Endogenous ethylene production takes place in the style which trigger wilting senenses of the flower. The most accepted pathway for synthesis of ethylene is methionine pathway. Biosynthesis of ethylene. It starts from methionine. Methionine is converted into S adenosyl methionine with the help of an enzyme adomet synthase. Now this S adenosyl methionine is converted into ACC which is also called as 1 amino cyclopropane 1 carboxylic acid with the help of an enzyme ACC synthase. Now this ACC is converted into ethylene with the help of an enzyme ACC oxidase at a temperature of uh, below 35 degree centigrade and with the presence of carbon dioxide. Factors governing the activity of ACC synthase. Stages of senenses. Production of ethylene is less in younger flower. Production of ethylene increases during flower maturation, opening and senenses of flowers. Oxygen level. During pollination, oxygen is transferred from pollen to stigma. Oxygen induces the production of ethylene. This auxin induced ethylene increased the synthesis of ethylene. Physical injury. Physical injury induced the synthesis of ethylene. Even the chilling injury induced the synthesis of ethylene. Classification of articulture commodities based on ethylene. There are uh, five classes. One is very low, low, moderate, high and very high. In case of very high, the range of ethylene is, uh, um, is below 0.1 microgram per hour at 20 degree centigrade. Um, it can be used for asparagus, ca cauliflower, cherry, citrus fruit. Whereas in case of low, um, the ethylene concentration range from 0.1 to 1 microgram per hour. Examples or the commodities are brinjal, chili, cucumber, green capsicum, okra. Moderate concentration will be range from 1 to 10 microgram per hour. And uh, commodities are banana, gava, fig, lychee. And then in case of high concentration, it range from 10 to 100 microgram. Uh, and uh, commodities are apple, apricot, avocado, kiwi fruit, papaya, peach, plump and peach. Very high will range from uh, more than 100 uh, microgram per hour like sapota, passion fruit. So these are all the commodities in which the classes will be um, differentiated. Sources of ethylene. Ethylene gas, a pure ethylene gas enclosed in a can or a cylinder is sprayed or injected into the chamber. Ethylene portable can can contain 3 gram, sufficient to ripen 2 to 6 tons of produce is available commercially. 
Etofen is used as spray or dip. Acidic uh, in water release ethylene. Ethylene mixture plus inert gas like carbon dioxide. Inert gas because not enough oxygen remain in the chamber to provide an explosive mixture. Example, ripe gas contains 6% ethylene. Ethylene generator, widely used method where liquid spirit produce ethylene when heated with the presence of catalyst platinized asbestos. Use of ripe fruits, cheap and simple wherein ripe fruit with high ethylene producers such as apple, banana, mango, sapota, tomato is used at home to ripe or degreen. Removal of ethylene. Eliminate the ethylene source. Provide proper ventilation. KMNO4 oxidize the ethylene gas into carbon dioxide and water. Brominated or activated charcoal absorb ethylene. Regulation of ethylene storage. Hypobaric storage. In hypobaric storage, the action of ethylene is low due to easy movement of silver ion at low pressure. Controlled atmospheric storage. The rate of ethylene synthesis is low at high carbon dioxide and low oxygen. Ethylene inhibitors. Ethylene inhibitors are silver chloride, silver nitrate, silver thiosulfate, methyl cyclopropane. Thanks for watching my video. Please subscribe to my channel by clicking on subscription button. Subscription doesn't cost you any money. To get a notification, click on a bell icon. Do like and share this video with friends and family. If you have any kind of feedback, do share it on a comment box. Thank you.